Uh, the Clippers talk a lot about being more competitive this year, and, and there are tangible ways to do that, playing more minutes. You saw Kawhi and Paul both play second night of back-to-back. Obviously, they had the winning streak against y'all. That was snapped tonight. Like, in what ways did this game feel like it was more than just, just another game? Hey, welcome back to NBA Cinema. Now, take a look here at, you know, LeBron James, you know, showing the, the Clippers love pregame. And watch Russ' reaction. Russ really don't um, don't f with LeBron. Take a look. Russ, 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 Now you could clearly see Russ was standing out of bounds, far along. The baseline because he didn't want to be a part of none of that pregame meet and greet with LeBron. Now, Russ, uh, you know, previously to the start of the game, you know, gave an interview where he was talking about he's happy to be with the Clippers because he's somewhere he was wanted, which leads to believe that, you know, he felt LeBron and the Lakers really didn't want him. Take a listen here at that interview. About how you, you, you look happier. Yeah. Since you come over to the Clippers, why is that that everybody says this? And and also you look at that you look happier than where you were before you got. Here. <laughs> well, long long list, but we don't got enough time for that today. But honestly, man, I think uh, one I'm I'm just and I know I reiterate this, but I'm I'm very grateful for an opportunity and a team that wanted me during a tough time. Um, just overall for myself and basketball wise um, being able to come to a spot where I was embraced and um, felt you know welcome and from then I, I, I told myself that I will give and like I've always done give everything I had now it's clear he didn't feel like he was embraced or appreciated um, in a Lakers jersey um, with LeBron and uh, AD and the crew and so this was kind of a get back game, but LeBron, I mean, LeBron is always listening and watching. So while he may say things that are politically correct, you have to watch LeBron's actions and you can tell this was not just a regular game and he admits as much. Um, take a look here at uh, some of the highlights along with what LeBron had to say in regards to facing this LA Clippers team, their um, you know cross town little rivals. Uh, the Clippers talk a lot about being more competitive this year, and and there are tangible ways to do that. Playing more minutes, you saw Kawhi and Paul both play second night of back to back. Obviously, they had the winning streak against y'all that was snapped tonight. Like, in what ways did this game feel like it was more than just just another game? I think it's always more than just another game. Every time you're playing your cross hallway rival, it will be cross town rival at some point when they, uh, you know, when they head over to, uh, you know, to their yeah, to their arena next year. But um, you know, it's um, for me, it's always great just to compete versus the best. And uh, PG and Kawhi and Russ are three of the best that this league has ever seen. And to be able to be on the floor against them and compete while I'm wearing the purple and gold and they're wearing their colors and competing, um, it's just definitely a blessing. And uh, you don't take those moments for granted. So um, it was definitely fun. I was happy. Um, I even stated, you know, I was like, I hope those guys are playing because uh, I just, you know, that's what the game is about, being able to compete versus the best. I hope they're playing tonight. And, uh, you know, it was fun. I mean, PG hit. Some big time plays to send it in overtime. Kawhi was spectacular from the beginning. I think he had like their first th 13 out of 15. Uh, Russ was great tonight, you know, hitting his jumper and getting into the lane and, you know, doing what Russ does. And, you know, myself and AD and the rest of the guys, we were just trying to, you know, go at them as well, you know. And D Lo was right there with us. AR was right there. C Wood. It was a big time game. I mean, for, for, for both teams. Win, lose, or draw, it was something I believe that both teams felt like they got better. and. The fans got a great show.